Well, good morning. I can actually say it by, it's 10.24. And I've actually been up for a while. Um, this is day five of the purge. I've given up for now. I got the closets done. I got some of the drawers done. But tomorrow I go to watch the grandkids for five days. Um, I, I found out my friends all have bets on me. <laughs> when is she going to give up? <laughs> so I will have to tell them. Um, I've been up since 7.30 because I need to get some things done around the house. Um, when I had my oil changed, they said my uh, battery cables were corroded, so I was out there this morning before the sun got too hot, and I was taking baking soda, water, and a toothbrush scrubbing them. Um, I think I need to pull them and do a little more um, severe of a job. Um, just want to make sure I'm getting <sighs> fairly good contact electrically. I noticed that um, my air conditioning, um, when I had it on the other day, because I actually took a day off and went to Ross, had great lunch with my friends. It was like at a Oh, I call it Pantera. I think it's Pantera. Um, bread place. And they have the greatest. Like, I have this turkey sandwich with this uh, their own, like, sauce and Gouda cheese. And it's just, like, yum. And I do the half um, uh, sandwich and um, bo little bowl of soup. I had uh, cream of broccoli, excellent, um, but I would eat their sandwiches every day. Uh, as a matter of fact, I think I may. Um, so we had a great lunch, then we went downtown, had coffee with some other friends. So we went to several stores, but I only ended up buying things at Ross and then Salvation Army. Um, we went at my insistent and everybody walked out with a bunch. I only walked out with a couple items. Um, I'll show you the haul. But I was out doing that. I did my cables, scrubbed the, the corrosion off them, the battery cables. And then I uh, did some weed whacking. Um, my arms are sore from doing that. So I don't know how still I'll be able to. When you weed whack it, I don't know, it just does my arms in. And um, weed whacked myself pretty good. That was the first, I felt really stupid. So I came in after I was done and um, put peroxide and cleaned it out. And I can't find the peroxide cap, so I'm on the hunt strange day. Oh, there's not, uh, mm, not a lot going on because I need to do laundry, uh, to get ready to go. Um, <sighs> my hand hurts. Um, and then kind of start the packing. Um, I would give you packing tips, but I'm like the worst packer. I used to travel quite a bit, and I used the roll method. I roll everything up, I put stuff in baggies, uh, throw stuff in my makeup train case, and I'm out the door. Oh, and electronics, because um, the other grandma is for sure coming, the great grandma. So it's the grandma's watching them, but she has some laptop woes, so I do have to bring my laptop, um, and I'll vlog while I'm there. 
You get to see the grandmas take care of the kids. I think it'll be fun because it's like real life with kids. And they are really funny at six and seven. I mean, they just crack me up. So, but I'm not a great packer. I don't pretend to be. I don't go out and buy fancy stuff to pack with. Um, I just use whatever suitcases are around. I don't care. I'm only going like an hour away. So, I mean, what does it matter? Um, so, I'll continue doing stuff. And I'll show you my home. Well, this is my haul stuff uh, from Ross. I got um, one, two, I got four shirts. They're sleeveless. This one I'm not sure about. It's a um, v neck, but it was only $8.99. And it's just. You know, I would say like, you know how on A-line dresses, they're like A-line short uh, sleeveless. And this one's really cool because it's got little, I don't know if you can see them, but it's got little shiny sequences sold on. It's real lightweight. And this was the thing. This one I love. It's got this cool skull. And it like dips down. And it's got a little, I don't know, kind of like a hangy sleeve. But it's still, I think, sleeveless. And it was $9.99. Then this shirt, I normally would not have bought. Because I'm not real crazy about, you know, colored stuff. But it's really kind of wide at the bottom. It's got this little diamond just over one flower. And again, it was probably, let me look. Oh, it was $10.99. But it's really soft. I just really love the material. Then this one's kind of like a fancy one. It's uh, got... Um, gray material underneath silky and then a lace over top and it was $9.99 but it's got this really cute bow on it so remember I told oh and I bought a pair of black cotton like I guess they're not I guess they're kind of like short capris or long shorts. Um, I bought them a size bigger because the size that I wear fits me. It fit, but a little too tight. Then remember I said I was going to look for a men's white shirt. and it, I just couldn't figure out one. But I did buy a bunch of men's cotton boxer shorts to wear for summer. I thought that would be really cool. You know, with the tank top, really cool to sleep in. So, let's see. I think all of it came to seventy-four, seventy-four, seventy. Then at Salvation Army, about this giant pair of like, I don't know. Just gym shorts. They have pockets. And they're really soft. And I really liked them. I hope they're going to be just. They look like they'll be longer. And baggy. And that's what I want. Then my friend had suggested to get a white men's shirt. So I found one. And. Oh. The gym shorts were like half price and they were like $3.99 half price. So take figure that out. So I got a long men's white shirt. And she said it's good for putting over shirts. And the reason why I bought it is it had this kind of collar. 
the other ones had collars that were like too thick. They were like men's dress shirts. And I don't like those collars. I tried on one and it's just too big for me. I mean, they just, they like stick, the, I don't know, that maybe they would have relaxed after washing them. I don't know. So that's what I got. So I was really happy to find the shorts. Uh, um, and because they're almost all cotton, that's why I went one size bigger. I bought some, washed them, and I mean, I could wear them, but they weren't really comfortable. And I'm not crazy about tight feeling clothes. I like, I'm kind of like the loose clothing girl. I always have been. It, you know, which pays off when you have a little bit too much around the middle. But even when I was thinner, I just, I don't like my clothes to fit tight. Um, I think good fitting clothes fit just a little loose. Um, they hang nice. Um, I have a couple friends that I think it makes them look chubbier than what they are because they wear tight fitting clothes. That's just my opinion. Well, I need to, like, I can't believe I haven't, I've only had one cup of coffee and I've I am now just drinking a breakfast drink. So, I hope you like the haul. I think I did excellent on the um, shirts, the sleeveless shirts. Um, I think with the capris and, and shorts I have, and then the addition of the black shorts, I think, you know, I'm good to go for a while. Um, dresses I looked at dresses and some of them are just like the ones I own just you know like different colors so and I have like four I think I took inventory and it was four long ones and four short ones not to the knee you know so I think I'm good so well, I'm gonna go drink the breakfast drink and get some more coffee well, I've gotten all my trash out. <laughs> the recycle is done. Um, so I'm sitting down to have a cup of coffee. And I think I'm going to make chicken salad um, with the leftover chicken. Just sounds really good. Nice chicken salad on toasted bread. Mm -mm -mm. Um. So, just probably by the time you see this, I will be almost heading back. I pre-recorded quite a few because while I'm there at my daughter's house, um, they have like a wimpy Wi-Fi. Their internet's just slow. It's almost insufferable at times. Um, so I won't be able, so I'm uploading stuff now that I can just put public while I'm there. Um, so, let's see, I've got my first load of laundry going. It looks like it's going to be another dark load and then a lighter load. And it should be done then. So that won't take long. Um, uh... So that's where I'm at. Just, you know, I got my, my clothes off from doing the yard. It was just, it was getting too hot. It's a nice, it's warm today and I have the fan going, but it's not like insufferable by no means. Um, but I think my next step is to make a list because I have to bring, like I said, um, my ex-mother-in-law is having computer problems, so I'm looking right now for my smaller screwdriver so I can take her laptop apart. Um, I think I did one of those things again. I put it where I wouldn't 
forget where it was. And I think it might be on top of the refrigerator in that white basket I put everything in. So I'm going to drink some coffee and um, maybe make some chicken salad. Well, I'm on the second load of laundry. Um, I was just laughing because look, my friend, when she travels, let me put my glasses on. She brings me all the extra, because she travels like a lot. Um, hold on, let me open it up. So I was just laughing because a friend of mine, when she travels, she brings me like if they have really good products. And this is white tea, aloe, shampoo, lotion, conditioner, and then some avocado face body and I love these green things I think it's when she stays at the Hyatt she gets these but so what's funny is she brings them back from when she travels for me and I take them when I go to my when I travel so <laughs> I think it's really funny well it's real nice because this way I'll just you know literally throw in the bag and, you know, I'm good. Um, depending on what my daughter's using at the time, sometimes I like them, sometimes I don't. Um, it, uh, she uses, because she uses a lot of, of hair products, treatment. I mean, she a lot, a lot, a lot of heat. Um, so her shampoos and conditioners can be they just drag my hair down so so I got the second load going I mean it's just one of those days um, again I think I'm trying to get too much done in one day because I folded up um, a load I needed to fold so I just I left them in the dryer accidentally so I just fluffed them up and folded them um, so I've got but like I forgot I still because last night I made sure I ran the dishwasher so I have to empty it so again it's one of those days where I think I'm trying to jam everything in one day <sighs> Oh, and I, for those of you that have been watching my TV, or listening to about my TV view, I've gone through, I'm up to date on, uh, I think I have one episode to go on the 100. I love the promise, I really, it, you know, it's, it's, I just love it. I like it a lot. Um, see, what else have I been watching? Um. Uh, of course, The Real Housewives of New York. I love them and New Jersey. Um, what else am I watching? Game of Thrones. Love, love, love the Game of Thrones. Gave up on Breaking Bad. May someday retry it, but not now. So I'm happy on that. Um, and um, also watching on Netflix, um, Orange is the New Black, because the season two, two is going to be starting. So I'm re-watching it. If you've not, if you have Netflix and you've not seen Orange is the New Black, trust me, watch it. It's really funny. <laughs> well, I'm trying to get to making chicken salad. I think I'll do that next, and then I'll load the dishwasher. Ay, 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 ay. I truly, I think I'm trying to get too much done. And I still haven't ground coffee to take with me, because I'll be grinding for two. Um, uh, the great grandma and me. So I'm gonna have to grind a big thing of it up. Um, I'll do that later. I don't f see the problem with grinding coffee is it absolutely makes me crazy. I can't stand it. 
and I was supposed to take a pill at one. I just remembered I did not take it. Nope, the alarm went off. I turned the alarm off, but I did not take it. Shame on me, shame on me. So let me go take a pill and make some chicken salad. Well, I did it. I just chopped up the white meat. And um, I had some purple onion already cut up. Added a little bit of mayo, um, salt and pepper. I might have to add more salt because I think the salt container is like plugged up. I just washed it a little while ago. Maybe I put salt in it before it was dry. Oops. So, I'll eat that on toast. Um, and I think I'll wait just a little bit longer, but it's done. And I'll unload the dishwasher. <gasps> oh, 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 I'm getting closer. Well, it's coming along. I've got the last load in the washing machine. Um, have the paperwork stacked up that I need to get to when I get back. Um, I do support on a couple forums. They're uh, veterans forums. So I've got that turned over to a friend of mine. Um, my ex-father-in-law was like the closest thing to a father I had. And out of respect to him and dedicated to him, I do a couple support forums. Um, they're closed forums. They're not open to the public. One is for women and um, uh, whose husbands are deployed, I think just deployed. Uh, I don't know, it might be all military wives. Um, I do simply, I make them and support them. It's not my business what goes on there. The other one are for disabled vets. When they've come back, um, they try to help each other. Um, so I've got that turned over as of tonight. So, um, and I have a stack of paperwork I have to get through when I get back. But, grandkids come first, um, always. Uh, family should come first. I mean, it just is, I think in this day and age, we've gotten where family kind of comes second. And that's why I really love that my uh, daughter and my son-in-law they take family vacations to spend the time with their kids you know in a fun environment somewhere new somewhere exciting they do something uh, see dolphins um, they're they're all beach people my grandchildren are truly beach babies um, so that's where I'm at just waiting for a load to dry so I can fold it up and then I'll start putting on my dresser what I want to take and I'm kind of like when I'm in the bathroom I'm kind of like sorting through what I'm going to take um, I mean it's not high makeup <laughs> obviously but um, I have started wearing makeup again and um, I'm really liking it I <laughs> love it not a lot, but something to make me feel better. Oh, this is like my new favorite thing. I got this Pixie lip balm tinted. See? And, uh, it's got water on it. I don't know what I did to it. Um, it's really moisturizing, not ultra. I mean, it will not replace my vitamin E stick. But it looks really strange, the color, but it doesn't go on that. It's just called Pixie Pink. 
I like this. This is one of the few tenant ones that um, Birchbox or Ipsy has sent me that I really like. Love, love, love. So I think now it's almost three. I mean, I've been busy, busy, busy. Um, I was going to put my work clothes back on and go weed whack, but it's thundering. I'm not sure what's going to come of it, but I've done enough. <laughs> I'm going to finish the few things, the few chores I have to do, and then I'm actually going to, like, watch a movie or something because I don't need to be wearing myself out before I go to wear myself out watching the kids. <laughs> Apparently they are busy, busy beavers. My daughter is already, you know, on the verge. Um, summer has just begun. She runs them to the pool. That helps. So I may have to call the great grandma and say, bring your swimming suit. Uh, we can live through the embarrassment of it. No. I think, you know, if you can't accept your age and how you look, like, you know, yesterday when I was shopping, not yesterday, it was the day before. Was it the day before? I'm getting lost because I didn't vlog for a couple days. Um, you know, um, the, I went with two of my friends and we were trying pretty much the same style shirts on. And actually the same shirt a couple times. And it was like, do you like this better? Fine, you buy it. And it's like, oh God, I have old lady arms. I don't know if I want to wear a sleeveless. It's like, get over it. <laughs> you have old lady big deal I mean you have to feel comfortable in your skin first I mean you, you know if you don't like you then nobody else will um, I, you know but I don't believe in plastic surgery and stuff like that I just don't I mean I've had all this surgery to remove um, skin cancer and it's just no fun I after this I mean if I ever thought I might be interested in having a facelift it's like no no uh no 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 so I think there's too em too much emphasis put on um certain parts I think if you want to wear makeup to feel good I love perfume um, I love high heels. I mean, there's just certain things I love. Um, oh, by the way, went and got a manicure. French, my favorite. Yeah, it's, what is it about? Like, <laughs> I'm only going to watch the grandkids for, you know, for four days. Because, um, I'm going over tomorrow, but my daughter and son-in-law get up early in the morning like you know I don't know four to leave three or four and um, so yeah might as well be sleeping there why get up and go I'm not gonna go over that early so I'm gonna spend that night so I'm not really babysitting that night um I lost my total train of thought dun, 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 dun went completely out of my head. Oh, I think it's just I'm going to babysit, but I still want to look nice, you know. Um, I have no problem with that. Um, but you are just who you are. Well, I'm going to go eat a chicken sandwich. I have a glass of water, and I think I'm going to go watch a movie.